Joris Karl Huysmans, Against Nature, is a seminal work in the decadent movement of the late 19th century. Published in 1884, this novel follows the life of its protagonist, Jean de Essientes, as he withdraws from society to pursue a life of aesthetic indulgence and decadence. Huysmans, through Des Essientes, explores the themes of artifice, alienation, and the rejection of societal norms. One of the central elements of Against Nature is the protagonist's relentless pursuit of artificiality and aesthetic perfection. Des Essientes, dissatisfied with the natural world, seeks refuge in an isolated villa where he meticulously designs an environment tailored to his refined tastes. His rejection of the natural world is evident in his disdain for the mundane and his preference for artificial experiences, such as perfumes, jewels, and carefully crafted interiors. Through Des Essientes, Hoisman's critiques the constraints of reality and champions the autonomy of the artistic imagination. The theme of alienation is also prevalent in the novel. Des Essientes distances himself from conventional society, finding solace in the artificial realms he constructs. His withdrawal is not only physical but also intellectual, as he rejects prevailing cultural and societal norms. The isolation he imposes on himself reflects a deeper dissatisfaction with the world around him, and this alienation becomes a means of self-exploration. Hoysmans portrays Des Essientes as a figure in conflict with the world, and through this conflict, he delves into the complexities of individuality and the search for meaning. Furthermore, Against Nature, can be seen as a critique of bourgeois values and the societal expectations of the time. Des Essientes' rejection of the natural and his embrace of the artificial challenge the prevailing notions of morality and conventional aesthetics. By celebrating the decadent and the unconventional, Hoysmans challenges the rigid standards of his contemporary society. The novel becomes a manifesto for individualism and a rejection of the stifling norms that Des Essientes perceives as limiting personal freedom. Hoysmans employs rich, descriptive language to evoke the decadent atmosphere of Des Essientes' world. The novel is a sensory experience, with detailed descriptions of scents, textures, and visual elements. This emphasis on aesthetics mirrors Des Essientes' preoccupation with the artificial and reinforces the idea that the pursuit of beauty, as defined by the individual, is paramount. The prose itself becomes a reflection of the novel's central theme, the rejection of the ordinary in favor of the extraordinary. In exploring the inner world of Des Essientes, Hoysmans introduces a psychological dimension to the narrative. Des Essientes' thoughts, desires, and fantasies offer a glimpse into the workings of a mind that rebels against societal norms. The psychological depth of the character adds layers to the novel, inviting readers to question their own relationship with the world and the extent to which they conform to societal expectations. In conclusion, Joris Karl Huysmans' Against Nature stands as a significant work in the decadent movement, offering a nuanced exploration of artificiality, alienation, and societal critique. Through the character of Jean de Essientes, Hoysmans challenges conventional norms and celebrates individualism. The novel's lush and evocative prose enhances the reader's immersion into Des Essientes' world, making, against nature, not only a literary work but a sensory experience that continues to captivate and provoke thought.